let you know. You found me. You handle that well. I should have heard him coming. Let myself get distracted. These people saw Mongols marching prisoners upriver. They had a blacksmith with them. Your brother? Sounds like it. They were taking him to a camp near the Canada Inlet. I know the place. Did you find any samurai to free your uncle? Not yet, but I'm still searching. I'm sure you'll find someone soon. Quickly, Kaka! Kaka can help you, after we save him. Hard to believe I might see him soon. He's lucky to have you. He might disagree. That's what siblings are for. What about you? Any brothers or sisters? Lord Shimura is my only family. What will you do when he's free? Take a breath. Because then I'll know there's hope for our island. You feel that strongly? I've watched him win victory against impossible odds. And after your brother is free, what then? Honestly, I haven't had time to think about it. You're riding well. How are your wounds? Mostly healed. Your bandages did the trick. You don't share much about how you feel, do you? <laughs> I suppose you're right. My uncle taught me that a samurai masters his emotions, like you master a horse, or a blade. That's a hard way to live. It's not supposed to be easy. There's a spot up ahead that overlooks the river. Should give us a good view of the Mongol camp. There's the camp. Tough to get inside. The Mongols threw that place together in days. There has to be a way in. Let's look. We need to reach Taka, without putting him in danger. We'll find a safe approach. You could scale the rocks on that side. If they're loose, they might give way. Alert the guards. Defenses in back are formidable. The front wall there is still under construction. Could be a way in. We can look for a gap in the front wall. Slip inside. And cut down the Mongols where they stand. If something goes wrong, they'll kill the prisoners. I've seen them do it. We have to go in quietly. Like thieves. What's wrong with that? Before the samurai, this island was ruled by criminals. We changed that by creating order and delivering justice in the open. We live by a code of honor. And sometimes we die by it. Warriors like my father, who just wanted to give us a safer home. I want the same thing. But we have to fight back. I promised my uncle I'd never break our code. Then bend it. To save my family. 
and what's left of yours. Let's get a closer look. See what we're up against. We should wait until it gets darker. Let's move. Taka. He's been through a lot. Even before the invasion. But you took care of him. Someone had to. He hated when I stole. But it was that or Star. He didn't have a choice. I didn't choose to be a samurai either. But going against my instincts. My code. It's better than getting wiped out by the Mongols. We have to fight back. Any way we can. Through here. If they see us, they'll kill the prisoners. Then we better stay quiet. Think, Jin. The bear's running with a limp. Your arrow wounded him. This is when a beast is most dangerous. Remain alert. Yes, Uncle. Keep after him. I didn't think bears lived here. They don't. But the fighting in Yarikawa drove some this way. So it's the rebels' fault. We should feed them to this bear as punishment. We are not barbarians, Jin. Bear stumbled here. Is it dying? No, but we're getting closer. Stay ready, Jim. Yes, Uncle. If it's still alive, can I take the shot? Prove you can control your emotions. Then... perhaps. We got him! Careful! He could still be alive. This arrow should not have killed him. Look, Uncle. There's a gash in his side, not from an arrow. An assassin! From Yarikawa! Traitor! You would stab the Chido in the back! Rosakai! Control yourself. We are not criminals like this man here. We are samurai. He tried to kill you! He must answer for this crime with his life. And look him in the eye. And teach him that samurai never acts out of anger or fear. And take his life with honor. Fight. We face our enemy head on. And when we take their life, we look them in the eye with courage 
and respect. This is what makes us samurai. 